so we're connoisseurs of cringe on this channel. Here comes but, the cringe. <laughs> but yeah, here, here, here. this isn't like you know the normal cringe type bad of cringe me stuff. boy. <laughs> Look, you guys. Anytime we do like a letter cringe video, everyone's like, "Oh, why, are you, why are you guys doing like this sort of stuff?" It's why like, are you well, on I think Reddit? it's funny. What are you some so, kind of Reddit YouTube channel? <laughs> yeah, so look, we're going to be doing some uh, D &D applications. Cringe. So I'm gonna. Well, you know what? The names aren't on these, so I'll, I'm gonna have to blank out names. But these are some little twenty applications. Let's just see what. what let's see what. What's this guy called? Look, Kane? look, look. The the first fact is says pronouns colon. Off. Get out yeah. Of you, get, yeah. Get back over the fucking gate. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> so, name Kane McLaughlin, which is already cringe as hell. Pronouns yeah. he, age 20. Experience with D&D, &D, one year. Any issues with political words like race, racist, racism? Race. Racism. <laughs> he's, he's. <re> <laughs> you don't say. Et cetera, <laughs> you don't no. Say. Kane's a special type of sorcerer he calls a rune master, and that he casts spells by channeling his energy through symbols and runes that he scribbles everywhere. He is a hand to hand fighter and an incredible acrobat, creating trinkets and gadgets he uses for his endeavors. Guns, this guy's a fucking sparkle troll. Guns, yeah. magical stabs, gauntlets, you name it, he creates it. His whole deal is that he was raised by a group of monks in a monastery where he trains to harness the energy within. Ha energy Witten. <laughs> <laughs> However, he seemed to not be capable of casting magic of the slightest bit. Despite this, he was treated as a brother, a son to the monastery. How? Despite this, however, what? What? The, to, however, to save his fellow monk from losing battle, from a losing battle, he brought out the power of the Agua symbol and punched the assailant with a massive water fist. This made him an exile, and for days he's hunted. He's. Uh, I hate this already. This Mary C. Mary C. Mary C. I, 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 I am so cool. Mary Stu. I'm the avatar. Also an engineer. <laughs> yes. Also a rune master. Also an acrobat. Also a monk. Fuck off. Uh, uh, this one's name. 14. Why are they all have pronouns? Good God. <laughs> so, but uh, but I believe the character is 14, and the character's name is Rain. Yeah. So Rain oh, right. okay. he 14. Experience with D and D started this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, is, so he's tried 18 times? Does that mean? Like, does this mean he's, this is his 18th application? Yeah, yeah. He hasn't he, played he, yet? he's applied 18 times. <laughs> I'm amazed. I'm amazed. <laughs> Put poor fella. Oh, you poor wee bob. <laughs> uh, you'll get there. Oh, you, you know, you'll, you'll, like, you'll work it out. Don't you oh, worry. The wee lamb. <laughs> I'm, yeah. I, I'm a mage character who would like to get a hands on approach, so he's willing to use traps and simple weaponry. Don't expect this mage to use anything but magic he may be human he may be a human man but his tactics are that of a goblin given the resources and situation would like to properly learn the sword 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 god damn it sword the sword if given the chance by an experienced person appreciates the dice these thieves will be bested by a thief these thieves will be bested by the tactics of a thief uh character name roya F roya flask lot Fuck. So God, I'm gonna say forgot Flascott. Human mage Maybe, I fifteen don't. Actually I I think he is fourteen. Fuck me. Mage uh, fifteen. You know what? Uh, no, 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 no. Let his shame be known. He, If his shame is known, he will grow up a better person. We do not no. coddle here on... on no, 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 don't, don't, don't coddle him. Don't coddle this wee lamb. He must know his mistakes and know he is wrong. Uh, he's, uh, he's a, like, we've all been cringe at 14, though. You know what I mean? It's hard. Yes, you yes, know, I, I get that. I, but, but he will learn faster than we. Yeah, <laughs> uh, maybe, maybe. Leave maybe. him in. Don't, 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 don't yeah, you, you leave him in there. You leave him in there. <laughs> Right, okay, fine. We'll leave this up. In. Right, you gotta. Well, as a history nerd, I was thinking I would do something like play an elven highwayman artificer with a clutch of flintlock pistols from what from form from water from water deep in a checkered past. <laughs> okay. God damn it, man! <laughs> Use uh, okay a checkered past but have a soft spot for kids and always smiling. I'm a history and engineering nerd who likes to tinker and build stuff. If you don't like players who like to tinker and are trying to make stuff with various ideas of crazy metric invention and see what can be done, 
commas. And you know curious. what? You, you, you know the thing is, see, when it comes to that sort of stuff, you kind of just always after you sim, they're just going to start pulling magic items out of the hole. Absolutely. You just know that that's yeah. going to be the case. If you just know finally like, yeah. they're going to try and break it as much as they possibly <laughs> can. Um, I've got the magic item that will get us out of every single situation. Behold, now, don't get me wrong. I think, Aha. <laughs> <laughs> don't get me wrong. You can do this. Like I feel like you know, if you have a lot of like you know, you can pull off a lot if you've got a grappling hook and good decks or like uh, block and tackle you know there's a lot of like or cult drops or whatever there's tons and tons of items in most role playing games that are really useful but people just never use them so I've got no like you know I, you, you know what He's, that guy's not going to be doing that though he is definitely pulling magic items out of his asshole on demand mm-hmm. as far as whenever he needs it like, like a McGovern like, l- literally a McGovern vending machine just bzz, 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 yeah bzz. so if yeah you, that's exactly what it if is if you're if you, I, I, I didn't teach like sp- like I'm not great, but I didn't teach spelling classes on 4chan or some shit. If you're, <laughs> well, if, this is old twenty, so it is. Oh well, that that's already fucked. If you're interested in a player who has a, who, uh, who, uh, who 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 has a creative approach, it's like, like an orc who has a creative approach in a non-standard fantasy, more arcane punk style of play than hit. You know, I'm done. Nope, that's enough. Van, nope, moving along. Fuck this guy. Do you Fuck your talk, typing. Do you not want to talk to him? Do you do, not want to talk? Oh, man. I, I would say no for the fact he can't fucking spell or use the correct words. <laughs> the most basic shit. Yeah. <laughs> Plague, you know, I'm... I'm oh, I, like, okay, look, let's see what this guy wants to do. Pla- Plague Doc Plague 64. Doc 64. Hi, I'm new to D&D, and I've done two practice runs, but never got to finish them. I thought my character would be perfect for this. He's a ranger with a backstory about a family of poisoners. He dresses like a plague doctor. I hope to be able to join this <laughs> D&D session. I see no problems um, here. What? Is, uh, yeah, that's... Is, is, is uh, it, yeah. Is this cringe? Like, basically, yeah. his, his ranger pet's a rat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it I, I, I mean, I think like you know, you could work that. I think you could, you know, look, look. Yeah, uh, of, of what we've seen, he's not cringe. <laughs> yeah, he's probably the best out of the lot so far. You know what? I'll, 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 I'll give you a go. I'll, I'll let you, let you away with it. The, oh, the, actually, the fact he spilled correctly is already. <laughs> Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll let you away with that one. You can have that. Okay, so 5e online. I don't know what the time. A, E, S, T. Where that's, is that? That's Green Mountain time, plus 10. Oh, um, right, okay. Looking for a new <laughs> group of fellows to play and have some good laughs with. Just about my setting works. Just about any setting works fine for me. What's what? What's up, y'all? As stated above, I'm looking for a group of people to play 5e with. I would rather have a campaign where a character backstory matters and can be explored and make personal goals as the campaign progresses. I already have a character. I won't spoil too much, but they are a warlock that seeks to bring back their patron to the material plane and have a fair and have a fair one-on-one. Oh, and have a fair one-on-one to the death. And if they succeed, they will take their patron's place and re- restart the cycle. They are heavily inspired by Supreme Calamitas from the Calamity Terra mod. Sometimes, times that we can play can be negotiated. If you want to join slash add me to your campaign or I miss anything, you can pin me or comment. Uh... uh he just wants to be the main character. Yeah. That's that, pretty much that, it. There's not much else to... The, the, uh, the, 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 well, there are two cringe things here. A, LGBTQ plus friendly, because no one actually cares <laughs> in D&D 5 and, yeah, uh, See, that's the thing. Like, I I feel like... No one cares if you're gay. No, no, no one cares. No, no, one, no one really does care. I think all they want is they want... Uh, you know what? I don't care. I'm, I, I I honestly just don't care about this stuff anymore. Just keep going. I feel like I talk about this stuff all the time, and honestly, I just could not give less of a fuck uh, um, at this point. You know, I'm, I'm not playing your game, okay? Like, let's see. Online flexible. A guy with ASD. What's ASD? Uh, I don't know. Hold on. Let's see here. Let's Google ASD. ASD. Uh, autism. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Okay. Uh, a, a man after my own taste. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> I see. Uh, still oh. looking. <laughs> A person of my religion. Um, I guess an introduction <laughs> yeah. would be nice. Oh, why people do this? I'm high. Twenty-one, about to be oh. twenty-two year old, year old with autism who would love to love a chance to play some of the concepts I've been struggling to get games for. I'm a lover of TTRPGs, text or B, a BPP. I can do voice, but only for out of character, not for role play. What? The? But unfortunately, okay. a lot of my characters are underage due to me using it as a coping thing. Whoa. Okay. We're, get, we're getting a bit sus here to get um. to get a bit of my immature out and at a lot of tables in the in the TTRPGs I don't like I like don't allow that as well as some adult characters concepts that have been giving me issue to find a table for if the concept of me playing these characters bothers you then kindly just move on instead of trying to knock me for it and please give me a chance to, if you if you're on the fence I promise you won't regret it 
I've been uh, using primarily Discord to find games, but decided to try Reddit. I have a friend who will probably be joining with me as well, but doesn't have to. So basically, he wants to play a child? Uh, I mean, like, what do you want to do with it, though? Like, can you... I feel like I, I would like more information. Are you talk, Are you saying you want to play, like, a 16-year-old or whatever? Or do you literally want to play, like, an 8-year-old? You know what I mean? Those guys are... you playing a vampire? Are, are you... Yeah, but those guys are usually... They, they, they can either... Uh, can or, or can or cannot be sus. It depends on how they play it. Yeah. The it's thing it's is, either hyper sus or it's it's not at all. See, there's I, not much in between. I, I, I had a guy play a 14-year-old once in a game, but he was very straight laced and wasn't anything weird mm. so like it but i but i know there are guys who will like fucking <laughs> make it somehow worse and, yeah. and, and we all know yeah. how they'll do it you know what i mean like, yeah. like we, we all know where this can go <laughs> yeah see the problem is i would argue the problem is the guy has autism and therefore let's be serious speaking from uh, experience uh he probably isn't the best when it comes to social interactions and therefore he's gonna make a hack of it and it's gonna end badly for everyone i i i don't really th and also he says he wants to use this game as like a coping mechanism for him um i'm sorry i'm not gonna be your therapist i'm just not you know what i mean i'm i've got no interest in that at all um let's just keep going i don't really have anything else to say on that one for the game my fellas. boyfriend male 26 and i'm so yeah so the def uh, often create <laughs> <laughs> you can't say that girl I'm oh sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry, I'm sorry. They're, gay. they're gay look i'm not wrong i'm not saying it in a bad way i'm stating the obvious yeah all right okay but, but i eating pussy <laughs> <laughs> all right okay let's just keep look, going whole, i already got awarded just 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 bleep it out but it's, it's still funny just bleep it out all right <laughs> all right so my boyfriend and i often create character concepts while driving long distances and over the holidays we made two characters that we love to play together already kind of based we are both experienced uh -huh. dnd players and we are and we both dm occasional games but we decided to try and find a game where we can both play play in this year we are hoping that we can find on here or other hamilton related social media communities a game that can accommodate two new players or a brand new one to start in the proposed character are as follows jimmy sweet pepper <laughs> <laughs> what why why is that funny <laughs> I don't know. Jimmy Sweet Pepper. That's, that's a dope ass fucking name. Yeah. A mark of hospitality kind of halfling like with dreams of being a chef that travels to the big city for an apprenticeship at a fancy restaurant, but ends up eating dodgy Aboleth sushi, which turns him into an ab aberrant mind sorcerer. Buck, okay. a, a dragonborn artificer. Art of, artificer. I always say that wrong. Eventually, alchemist barista who travels with his grandfather's giant semi-broken espresso machine, trying to understand and repair <laughs> it while earning enough while earning enough money to open up in the family diner. Oh my god! You know what? I on one hand, I think this is actually really. Is it funny. bad that I don't? On the other hate hand, that? <laughs> I, on one hand, I do actually think this is kind of funny, but on the other hand, this screams leading citadel to me, where it's like oh, everything. Yeah, yeah, or yeah, do, yeah. you know, do you do you want to do like the food competitions? Do you want to go to the street market? Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? I, on one hand, I do think this. If you did this, I think you could actually make a fun, wacky. Like I think this would work really well for like spell jammer. Or oh, something spell like that. jammer. Yeah, um, yeah. That'd I, be awesome, I think this. I, I I do think I it love would work the uh, I, I, I love the uh, dodgy sushi thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I actually think that is kind of funny. <laughs> but I just know, you, the thing is, you just know it's. Uh, so okay, uh, you so, know what? So, like we'll, we'll give this guy the benefit of the doubt. Let's just say it's actually not cringe. It's so be cool, these but I know the, it's not going to work out. The, these gay boys ain't half bad. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll give you just credit. All right, let's see. So uh, here, Link link during the level one, one character sheets. sheets. Uh, using uh, Senator Ray's and Tasha's ancestry and culture rules, they also include a more detailed backstory such description. If anyone is interested in having these characters, okay, so but, okay, here's, here's the thing though. Like me and you, we, we're pretty spicy boys, but we gotta give credit where credit's due. These, 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 these two gays made some pretty cool characters. Actually. <laughs> yeah, actually, I, I I don't actually hate it. I think that I, I actually I quite really like, like it. The, yeah, the, the, yeah I'll, I'll give I'll give them you, credit. You know what? You know what? You know what? Think, think you know what? Like a little, a little stamp. Uncringe. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They there you go. Not bad. Very cool. 
So I don't know if you know this, but we've got a website with lots of models. And whenever I say lots of models, I mean lots of models. We've got models for any setting that you can think of. With humans with biddies, animals that shouldn't have biddies but do have biddies, dwarves and elves with biddies. Look, we've got a lot of smut models. But it doesn't stop there. We really do have models for anything and everything. And to be honest, they look so good. Chef's kiss, so good. But it's not all smart for all you good Christian Minecraft server players. We've got you covered. And we even got the weebs covered too, which is unusual for this channel because we don't <laughs> like weebs. <laughs> yeah, the weebs aren't that bad. Are they? we, also, just that bad. <laughs> we also have 5th edition subclasses and adventures, which some of them are free for download. And we sell physical printed copy of Steel Water as well. And you can request a signed version if that's your thing, where I'll draw a penis on it for you. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, hey, if you want you know, us to sign a couple want, decks, that's we, what we, you we, want. We'll give you decks, okay, guys? That's, that's what anyway. You want. If you enjoy what we do here, go ahead and check out the website. It helps us out so so much, and we don't need to worry about our YouTube overlords striking down another one of our channels. Our website is also now available as an app on Android. Also, and the winner of the daily giveaway is this guy. Yay! Woo! <laughs> Look, anyway, uh, in for a chance to win, all you gotta do is like, subscribe, leave a comment down below, automatically entered in. And to claim the prize, you just send an email to neckbeardycontact at gmail.com. Let's get back to the video. I'm a new player. I'm sure a new player is a dime a dozen, but if you're looking for an extra player who has a lot of free time and a unique character to try out, please message me or leave a comment. Here's a description of the character I'm looking to use, though I'm willing to make a, one, a new one for a specific campaign if needed. An elven mage who takes pride in her beauty, intellect, and the ability to win a fight. Looking for new adventures and ways to enjoy herself as well as broaden her knowledge. Has a habit of collecting things to see if she can you if she, to, to see if she can get use out of them as she did with two exvili warriors while pl okay so this so okay okay hold on we're move past that wait is this wait is this uh, elder scrolls iliad ruins that might is be this, elder scrolls i think that is elder scrolls uh honestly this is boring the life out of me and well, i'm well, just well, not well, gonna well, finish well, it well, hold on scroll down scroll down scroll down all right so fine. as did before another thing really she takes pride in her beauty in order to preserve it she sold her fertility to a witch of the woods when she was when she was 57 in exchange for everlasting youth and has sold her fertility She's not uh, okay. immortal, but she's ageless. Okay, this is basically the uh, the, the reverse of the dragon guy with, with the giant express machine. This is just cringe. Like, <laughs> this, like this is just like yeah. this, is, this is like basically like like Mary Sue cringe. This is how this is how this yeah. cracks me up. Like like this is obviously retard cringe. The other one is actually kind of funny and interesting. But this is like, oh yeah, she <laughs> sold her fertility to a, to a, to, a, to a hedge witch. Fucking what? Sold your so, fertility? Uh, what? So so the witch can have babies now? Did you like rip your womb? out how the fuck did that work yeah like, so I, I'll, I'll tell you one i kind of was trying to go for it a while back so with gobby the way i was doing gobby was every time i leveled up he got older so um and i kind of we were kind of going for goblins when he lived to like they're like 15 or so oh, you yeah, know what i mean you, they're yeah. kind of like you know what i mean and that, so they're he was kind of getting worried about his own <laughs> mentality yeah yeah i was kind of that's what we were going for so i was i was thinking of what would Gobby do? He's a bit of a dastardly fellow. What would he do for uh, a, a couple of extra lad. years? <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. So I think that's probably one of the main reasons why he did team up with the why he sold his soul to a lich. Um, but before that, I was really thinking about what if um, turn like turn into like a mechanical construct. You know what I mean? Could he extract his soul into a different vessel? Maybe something like that. Um, it does kind of sound Mary Sue esque, but. Again, it was kind of more of the lines of um, he didn't have many years left anyway. So, you know, and he was aging way faster than everyone else around him. So uh, maybe I, I, I kind of can be something like this. But he'll end up just saying like, no, no, that's kind of ridiculous. But I was like, well, it's not going to change the gameplay at all. It's more just um, like role play and stuff. But he was like, eh, I don't know if I really want to do that because then every else, everyone else is going to want to do it. And I was like, yeah, sure. Why not? You know, anyway, look, let's keep going. 
one. That's really boring, though. I, yeah, you, I, you, actually, actually, I actually, it's, it. it's funny. That, 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 the thing is, so Sparkle Troll is actually boring and basic. Like, yeah, the the the, the duality is that that is that the two gay fellows, their characters are actually somewhat interesting and not broken. Hers is just <laughs> yeah. broken as shit. Yeah, that's just uh, that's <laughs> like, let's just keep going. Let's just this keep further going. proves I, uh, that men know how to make a character. <laughs> hey, y'all. Okay, this is gonna be great. Uh, Central. So so this guy's so, so this guy's on my time zone. <laughs> <laughs> huh. uh, on a quest to find a place for my D&D character, a human on a journey to eventually dual wield a named vampiric rapier that can siphon life force back when it punctures its target, and a named black katana or scimitar uh, that can cause lacerations okay. that festers or rapidly and will eventually spread gradually around to part to part, causing the flesh within its expanding covers to decompose. If you can lend me uh, a hand making this dream, look at that fucking Discord name, trash. You're fucking trash. Get out of here, trash. <laughs> trash pile. Trash. I'm, 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 Garbage pail <laughs> with legs. Fuck off. Yeah, I'm just not gonna. With my yeah, mighty katana just... and my scimitar. <laughs> Uh, absolute weebly at its finest. There you go. Uh, yeah, cringe. I don't care. Let's just keep going. <laughs> what? See, this is the problem. Well, always See, when it comes to like bad, bad cringe. Yeah. What? Folded steel garbo? Do you not get it? Shit, you got real in time. You folded steel. <laughs> yeah. uh, I wish I, wish I, I was dead. So <laughs> yeah. Looking for a group that will. Why is it always 5e2? Uh, looking for a group yeah. that will let me explore a certain character of mine. This is going to be weird. On mobile, so sorry about bad formatting, I will give you a benefit of a doubt. About me, 17 mm. male, played 5e for 1.5 years, love making characters out of weird HB races, or homebrew races, or weird yeah. concepts. Here we go. My character. Why is, why is homebrew so, so bad for 5e a lot of the time? A, a priestess <laughs> like, of Wolf. Oh, uh, okay. A priestess of Wolf. So you're in the wishes, dome then, I take yeah, it? He likes being stepped on by a giant spider. Yeah. He's a he's a cock and ball torture. Yeah. <laughs> Cock and ball torture, torture, torture. <laughs> yeah. Uh, which is what was that? I forgot again. What was that a lamb lunch, was it? I yeah. can't remember now. 16 naked cowboys in the showers. Of rain <laughs> yeah. <pants>. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, god. I, right. See, the, and, and that's why I love Pippa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, so. They wish to climb the ranks of religion by spreading it and making sacrifices, but will also be tested occasionally with the nine punishments of Loth, cuck and ball torture. Her, yeah. Oh, it's a her. Her goal after reaching yeah. so it's a so a young male playing a female character already kind of cringe. Her goal after right. reaching the top is to either be sacrificed to Loth or work as her proxy. Class races a paladin. <laughs> Of conquest, as I can see that. So it's a I spider it woman paladin in a human body. With, get, hold on, hold, hold. As an arachne, as in human body with retractable spider legs on the back. I don't know if this will work in a standard campaign due to the religious aspect of it, along with the fact that a main town slash city would be important because my character needs a base of operations. Oh, what? 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 That's, uh, I don't care. Like, the guy's into femdom. Next post. I can't even. I, I'm not interested. Well, the well, thing is, like, he's into fem on femdom. Like, like, that's even, like, <laughs> look, the guy just wants to be stepped on. Leave him I want right? my spider mommy to step on me with her many, many legs. <laughs> Ooh, please step yeah. on me, spider dance on my face. Anyway, yeah, what what happened? Like honestly, the thing <laughs> is, happened? I actually kind of, I, I, yeah, you know the thing is, I actually quite, I, I, it's one of the few things that I actually like about the Forgotten Realms is I, I do actually enjoy Loth. I do uh, quite like the guy. I don't know if that's just because I'm an edgy boy or not, but. Then you see stuff like this all the time, or you see anything with drizzets, and it's like, uh... Look at me, never look mind. at me, you are cringe now. Alright, let's see, what's I don't this know what one the... right here? God damn it. This one's really long, <clears throat> this one, right. Alright, 5e, of course. I have not got the opportunity to play a game in a really long time, I'm looking for a long-term game that would run either on Tuesday, anytime, or Sunday. It would be nice if the game was on the second week of January, but I will try to make it work if it is already planned to start in the first week. I'm okay with most themes in games. SA is very much out. SA. Oh, sex, sexual assault What's is very SA? much out, though, and I'm fine with just <laughs> voice or with voice and cam. Right. Okay, name. George or, Gra or Gom is fine, age 27. Um, been playing on and off since I was 13. Then this past April, I started a LGBTQ long-term campaign. A campaign? What? A, a gay campaign? What the? 
Okay, I gen- <laughs> no, it's it's like a normal campaign, but the gay. But gay. Okay. Uh, okay. I generally have more experience as a DM than a player, as I have DM three campaigns and a handful of one shots, two campaigns in four E, this one in five E. Okay, um, cis pansexual. What does that mean, cis pansexual? I swear I to God, this, they're sweet. trying to like cast a spell. Like, <laughs> no, but what is what is no, but ooh, so pansexual is pretty much bi, isn't it? Pansexual like, is a sparkle to way of saying you're bi. Okay, look, okay, ch- yeah. guys, there are three sexualities. You're either gay, straight, or bi. It's uh, only three. That's all you got. So he's so wait, does that mean so he? Oh, oh I it guess gets so worse. Pansexual. It gets worse. Hold no, on, right, hold okay. on. I like to learn in my free time, and I try to make a lot of information on mental health. I personally do go to therapy. <laughs> you don't say. <laughs> We're gonna see this. Uh, and see it as very important, so I'm not afraid to have tougher dis- tougher discusses within back limits. I'm American and have very liberal views, politically supporting BLM, defunding police, and movements of similar or more progressive natures. <sighs> I would like to play that, with that, that goes hand in hand. I you already knew that was the yeah, case. Let's you, be serious. You could already tell. I'm pansexual sis yeah. and you hate the police. Gotcha. Yeah, um, sure. I would like sure. to play with those that have similar in- ideals of my own. So nobody. Also for reference, <laughs> I have personal discomfort with overly toxic masculine energy from others. So lots of who's manly or bullshit or similar things to that. You got you, you know this guy's purple hair and a lot of uh. Funko Pops. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of Funko Pops. Oh my god! As well as you, you know, like. as well as discomfort with with just large and explosive forms of expression, mostly anger. This leads me to be far more comfortable with gender neutral or feminine aligned. So this guy, like I, I like to play with girls. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, something okay. like that. So, yeah, so, 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 okay. So, so scroll through this. I want Tortle Rogue. He was a gambling addict. <laughs> okay, what's this? Turtle. So he's a turtle goat. So may- Wait, so, so does he just want to see Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? So maybe, maybe with, with the character, these characters, he, he might be able to, like, you know, may, may, okay, hold on. They've resorted right, to cheating because they, because while they did not mind losing in their youth and genuinely play for enjoyment, the losses are more real than ever because of the need to support their family. The wife and mother. Oh, have fallen ill, and the father of my character will be taking care of my character's three children. But it's really just a matter of time for the two mothers. What the? F- I don't oh, know. Okay, I, so like next, next uh, one. I don't care. That's bored. So keep going. Minotaur, keep Minotaur going. Minotaur Ranger Ranger literally want to be as far away from as possible. Play the scout role or the ambush role. The party enters, and I flank or similar sort of strategies while out of combat, being much more secure as their appearance gives of this idea of a brawn. Uh, what the fuck? Okay, penguin, uh, or cockroach, or rabbit. <laughs> penguin. <laughs> That's actually, pe- actually, you know what? I'll get, like, I, I, you know what? Yeah, I'm, I'm down with that penguin or cockroach. So, funny, but I'm not or rabbit that. folk paladin, uh, dual wielding shields, worships an evil god, <laughs> worships an evil god, but genuinely believe in the goodness of the god's messages. Like, sure, the god wants to burn some stuff, but like, it's to help everyone. I would not play this character evil, as I don't like evil characters. Just more gray like societal outcast but true hope and belief for every for everything oh my god he just ruins <coughs> you it. Know what? he just ruins things that he touches <laughs> that's such a i i really love that idea the they're like penguin or cock right? I'm, I, I'm down with that that's our you know why, what that's that's why up there for me why, I'm, I'm down why, for that one. why would you put in, in your profile i love hating police and I love BLM. It's like, okay, sure, okay. So you have a black tattoo on your white butt cheek somewhere. What the fuck is this? <laughs> oh my god! Why is it, uh, right, why is it okay. always five that brings in like the the most like special <laughs> okay. <of> creations? <laughs> I'm 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 gonna explain it. So pretty much, if you want to play five E. IRL, it's so easy to do it. Every game store you'll ever go to, there's going to be some 5e groups there. You will have no issue getting in. The only people that aren't going to get into them groups, absolute freaks. Like, yeah, you know, absolute I mean, people that just, loops, dude. <laughs> yeah, you, you, people that will never be able to play any other way that they Which have is, to play. See, this is the thing, <clears throat> and this is where 5e players online, because it's so easy to play 5e in person, why are people choosing to play online? Unless it's like, you know, they're playing with their already friends and they're, they've moved about college, whatever, you know, and all that t- sort of stuff, or, like, you know, work and all that jazz, and it's the only way that they can play. So people that have to, like, post adverts and look for games, and if it's 5 a, you know you're in for a lot of issue. You know, this is what... Oh, oh my god. Well, so, uh. I mean, like, so far, those two gay dudes are, are the only based, <laughs> based ones we've had so far. I, I, th- I think they're really funny. I know. Okay, let's go uh, here, here we go. Because... It's, uh, she's already See, bigoted. <laughs> Out the gate, she's bigoted. <laughs> D and I, yeah. if you're a man, Man, 
Do you, do you not? What does that say? Do you not respond? Does that mean? Do not, DNI. What does that? I mean? Do not initiate usually. So more than likely, oh, this person right, is trans okay. and saying they're a woman. If they, if they meet a man, they're, they're going to add it probably immediately. <laughs> so hey, my name is Adelaide. Nineteen. She. Her. Every fucking time with the pronouns. No one cares. <laughs> Currently, we have two players yeah. in the DM. We're looking for one or more care. One or more. Pl- oh, they're trying to net in only female players. That's what they want. Oh, all right. Okay. So they're predators. Copy. <laughs> <laughs> Currently, my character is, <laughs> okay. a me- is, is a media, and the other character is a netrunner, so we don't have the best combat ability, to say the least, but we're looking for a solo or nomad. So scroll down. No racism. Uh, no fun. No homophobia, no. transphobia. So I told you. I told you. <laughs> I told you. I told you, homie. <laughs> okay, keep going. Keep going for the homophobia. No in or out um. of game sexual assault. Out, out of game sexual assault? What the? Like, what? <laughs> Huh? What? No, no okay. cop, no copaganda or cop characters. <laughs> okay. No. Well, you know what? Like, <laughs> okay, like, let's just keep going. No. Like, see, the thing is, this it makes no sense. See, when it comes to like a cyberpunk game. Oh, uh, by the way, uh, the corporations and the police are the bad guys <laughs> in a cyberpunk game. You don't say. You don't say. Stunning and brave. That's all I got to say. Let's keep going. Stunning and no brave. No tech. No. No techno orientalism. Oh, so it's gross, weird, and fetishizy. So basically, no Asians. <laughs> Wait, so it's like. Oh, like, no, we Is that because I. I'm. Okay. Uh, number six. I'm okay. not playing with conservatives. So here, here, here. <laughs> if you want to join, put your name, pronouns, age, and character in the comment. Okay, here's the thing, though. Here, here's here's uh, what it gets me. No, no conservative will say, I don't play with liberals. <laughs> I have never seen a, a, a like I've never never all, all, all my conservative DM friends, but you never once said, "Hey, no liberals allowed." It's only these fucking freaky Fruit Loops that are like, "No <laughs> conservatives allowed." <laughs> no cops. Uh, well, <laughs> no I, transphobia. Okay Honestly, I because <laughs> like you know, like I've got no interest in playing in their game. They've got no interest in playing in my game, so, even though my games pretty much never have any of this sort of stuff. So, in so, 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 so here's the thing. I have trans fans, right? And I'm fine with it. And I will joke with them and treat yeah. them like any other person. And me and this one uh, trans guy, we go back and forth with like the most horrifying jokes ever <laughs> invented by mankind. And one of his friends found our jokes and said, bro, he's being transphobic. And he says, yeah, I know. It's funny as shit, right? <laughs> Like, 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 <laughs> this trans guy's base is fuck because he 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 will sling shit harder than I can, and we'll literally just like I think for an hour and a half we were slinging like horrifying jokes at each other, and his and his his, his trans friends found the jokes like, bro, this is like the worst transphobia. And he goes, yeah, I know it's funny, right? <laughs> <laughs> like just uh, if if you if you train your entire life to take a dick, take a joke as well. Okay, come on. <laughs> My God. Anyway, look, look, guys. I think that's where we're gonna wrap up. No conservatives. Uh, uh, anyway, look. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one. <laughs> uh, look, we finally did cringe. That's actually on on topic, on topic. of this channel. Even though why are you guys uh, even doing though Reddit of this channel that's, is doesn't <laughs> involve game together. Build the head your face. <laughs> so uh yeah if you enjoyed that let us know and um, there's plenty more we've got loads more of these honestly there's uh there's mountains if this. you are triggered or insulted my email is robot ranch kansas at gmail.com send me your hate so we're gonna do a video on it make fun of you thanks <laughs> all right anyway look uh oh here check out uh garb blues kickstarter it's got at the time of recording 15 <clears throat> days left it's about to crack Twenty thousand. Uh, he's done amazingly well. Um, Should so I make really one good. of the war crimes um, transphobia? <laughs> um, do you have uh, do trans uh, creatures exist in your setting? I mean, <laughs> I got a few there ideas. Could be. I got a few ideas for the books. <laughs> 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 All right. Okay. Well, then, yeah. Why, uh, why not go for it? And then uh, also check out Death March. It's up on the website. <laughs> well, the war crimes is misgendering. Oh my god! Hold on. <laughs> before, before I forget, I gotta do it real quick. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> right, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> Check it the next time below, and uh, hopefully, we'll see you next time, alright? Yeah, we'll see you next time. Probably clothed. <laughs>